Hi everybody, I'm Jamie Proviance, and today I want to show you how to make a griddled corn cakes with grilled shrimp and a black bean relish. So this is something a little bit different. We're using the griddle today. Over on the left side of the grill, it has fabulous cast iron piece that is preheating. I've added a little bit of oil there so that it's nice and slick, non-stick surface. Today we're doing corn cakes, savory corn cakes. So let's talk about how to make those. I have here dry ingredients and wet ingredients. The dry ingredients are um, the cornmeal. It's a fine ground cornmeal with some all-purpose flour and a little bit of baking powder and some salt. And to that, I'm going to add the wet ingredients, milk and melted butter and an egg. And we're just going to whisk those together, stir or whisk. But you want to be careful not to do this too vigorously. If you overwork the batter, it tends to get a little stiff. This is how you want your batter to look when it's fully mixed. And now we go to the grill. We're working with a, a medium heat, about 400 degrees or so. And you want to take about a quarter cup, I'd say, for each corn cake and just spread it out a little bit. Kind of like making pancakes, but they're savory and they're corn based. Doesn't have to be perfectly round. And they're going to take somewhere between, oh, three to five minutes. It turns out that shrimp take about the same amount of time. So on the other side of the grill, I'm going to lay down a few shrimp. And you can be doing this in batches. You can be serving your guests food hot off the grill in, in batches. Or you can do a whole bunch at once. So, looks like my first batch is ready to go. Nice hot corn cake. I'll lay a little bit of uh, sour cream on top of each one. And then um, we will garnish with a beautifully grilled shrimp or two. Just like that. And then I'm going to serve these with a little uh, relish. This is made with black beans and some finely diced pepper, a little bit of lime juice and some garlic. Just put that around the plate. And how about we finish with a little sprig of cilantro. Maybe a little bit of uh, a little bit of lime for people to squeeze on top. And now you've got something that you probably have never grilled before. Instead, you're griddling. Try it. It's fun. And now you know how.